Hey everyone! So I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas and I just wanted to show you what I got today from the MAC Sean Pale and Stylishly Yours collections that came out. And uh, oh, those stinkers at MAC are releasing two collections the day after Christmas. How mean is that? <laughs> and then as if that wasn't bad enough, um, in another week, the Peacocky collection comes out, so it's like, boy, it's a good thing that I got some money for Christmas. <laughs> but, um, okay, so let me show you what I got today. I bought three things from the Sean Pale collection. Let me just get them lined up here. And then I bought one thing from Stylishly Yours. Okay, so let's start with uh, Champagne. I bought a feline coal pencil. Now, I've heard that this is like a fantastic, like if you're going to buy a coal pencil, this is the one to own. And it did come out with another collection within the last year, but I had purchased so many items from that collection that I wasn't able to get this too. So finally I got my hands on feline. And let me do a swatch. And it's just a really nice black coal pencil. And I'm looking forward to trying that because I, I know people who, like, that's their holy grail black eyeliner. So, very curious to try that. And then, um, you know how much I love paint pots, so of course I had to get one of the paint pots. Um, and the one that appealed to me the most was Dangerous Cuvée. And there's what it looks like in the pot. However, if you swatch it, it takes on a whole new dimension. Now, let's see, what would be the best way? I'm going to, I think I'm going to shine my makeup mirror light right on the swatch. That might make it, let's see. Hopefully, this is going to help pick up the subtleties of the swatch. It's like a silver paint pot, but it has a hint of purple to it, and then it has different colored shimmers within it. So hopefully you'll be able to see that. It is absolutely stunning. It's probably going to be my all-time favorite paint pot. There was no way that I could pass this up. That's absolutely gorgeous. Um, now, when I am making a decision as to what things I'm going to buy from the collection, because, you know, I try to pick out, like, X amount of um, money to spend from each collection and then go from there, um, sometimes I have like a mental checklist in my mind and then I get there and I swatch things and things are not, you know, as beautiful as they appeared online and vice versa. Well, the next thing I'm going to show you is one of those things that didn't look all that interesting to me when I saw it online, but in person was really beautiful. And what I'm talking about is the Rose Olay Special Reserve Highlight Powder. And this is what it looks like. And it looks kind of like the surface of the moon. <laughs> it's got all these raised areas within the pan. And when you swatch it, I'm going to change the angle again on the camera. When you swatch it, it's this beautiful rose highlight. And then that's what, let me put a little more on so you can see it. It's probably going to show up fairly subtle on my skin because I do have a hint of pink or I have pink undertones on my skin. But that's another reason why I thought this would work so great for me because it's, it's going to blend into my skin better and not be like so bam in your face like it might be on other skin tones. So I definitely think that this is very beautiful. 
So those are the three things I got from Sean Pale. And then um, Stylishly Yours, I definitely wanted the Dark Diversion um, Gel Fluid Line. And it's, um, it's like a plum, plum color. And um, as you know, recently I've been really getting into um, the gel eyeliners on my waterline. So, had to get that. <laughs> so those are the four things I got. And uh, like I said, there's another collection, Peacocky, coming out in another week. So I saved some money so that I could pick up a couple things from that too. They have uh, a whole line of new formula lipstick, but they're limited edition, with a ton of colors called Kissable Lip Colors. And then there's um, Mega Metal Eyeshadows. And I know they've come out with uh, metal eyeshadows before, but I don't own any of those. Um, so this is going to be something new for me, and there's a ton of colors of those. And so what I'm probably going to do is pick out like one lipstick color and one eyeshadow color just to, to try the items. But um, So that's what I got from the MAC collections. And um, that's it. So have a nice rest of the weekend, guys. Bye-bye.